<laughs> Did you know the little man on the Pringles can, his yeah. name is Julius? What? Yeah. Is it? Yeah, found that out this weekend. Are you joking? I've been eating Julius. Whoa. <laughs> Whoa. I've been eating the whatever. Once you pop, you just can't stop. What's going on, guys? I Welcome knew, to Take A Bow. I knew you'd say that. Well, yeah, Catchphrase is corny. You set me up. You are Welcome corny. to Take A Bow. This is the show where we get the funniest stuff on the World Wide Web. We package it and we deliver it straight to you. Craig Mitch, Steve-O the Madman. What's popping? Pringles. <laughs> ah. I set you up for that one. Yes. No, I didn't. That was better. That was better it, than yours. It was. It was better. No, yours is the original. All right, guys. So, it's starting to feel a lot like football. Oh, right. This is Christmas. Friendlies everywhere. You're one of them guys that starts celebrating Christmas now, though, innit? Kind of. You got your lights up? No. no football yeah. season. Football season's close, man. Bro, listen, the friendlies are popping up all mm. over the place. This is the time of the year where everyone gets excited for absolutely no reason about their club playing teams in countries that only just discovered football. I don't know why they do it, but we got to clutch well, on something. I think that if your club does well in pre season, you should get excited. All right, so let's kick it off with the comments. You know how this goes. So we'll go with the first one. Josh Smith says, I don't know why Mitch is talking about snitching. Like, we don't remember that episode of yeah. Filthy Fellas. What episode? I don't, know. I don't remember. You said that you would snitch. On what? What was the context? I can't even remember, but I just remember you saying... I would snitch. Yeah, you said you would snitch. <laughs> no, in fact, you done a... We didn't even report it on air. When you said about, um, you actually snitched on Ibrahimovic. You, you tweeted the FA. Do you remember that? Uh, yeah, oh, you I did. did, you did, yeah, you I did, did. Yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah, I, yeah, I'm a snitch. Uh, Sylvester O. Johnson said, I'm watching from Sierra Leone, West Africa. Love the show, guys. Never miss an episode. Well, I'll go around Big Sylvester. up, yes. Give us reminds some diamonds. Of, reminds no, me of the cat. <laughs> Such a donut. So, so we said? Big up Sylvester. Why? Reminds me of the cat. Tweety Pie and Sylvester. Oh yeah, that's old school. Exactly, you uh, remember that. I, yeah, I don't. Natscape 7 said, this show is underrated in my opinion. True. But you're right. It's not just your opinion, it's a fact. You've it added something there. It says Imo. Where? This show is underrated Imo. No, in my opinion. It's an acronym. It's a what? Acronym. The algebra. Sky Italy, Arsenal want a swap deal with Chelsea. Alex Oxlade Chamberlain for Nemanja Matic. Mm. Now, this is a shrimping special. This guy is apparently King Shrimper. He's the king of all shrimp farmers. He does the most. And uh, he's, he's come got, up with this one. He's got the tick, bro. Yeah, but I have the tick. Mm, that's true. You have the tick. I love how I say that. If he's not signing the new thing, He's got to go, because look, I can understand why they would hold Alexis Sanchez hostage or Meza Ertz mm -hmm. hostage, hostage if they could potentially win the league. Chamberlain, it's like, yeah, you, you had a good six months or five months, but you're not that calibre, so I'd cash in on him. He's still young as well. But what are you going to, for Chamberlain, what would you get with one year left on Chamberlain? I reckon in this climate... Ted Mill. What? In this climate? I'm going 28. With one year left yeah. on his contract, yeah, in Craig? this climate, 28, yeah. Oh my God. Why not? In this, Carl Walker just went for 50 M's, bro. He's 29. He had five years or, or four years on no, his contract. Okay, he's 29. Who would be getting the better deal, Chelsea or Arsenal? Because I think. Matic, I mean, I think they need a real DM. Yes. And then he's been, uh, you know, uh, who's the like guy him. that came in? Granite Xhaka, uh, mm. Coquelin. Uh, mm. Like, they, none of them have really, you know, they haven't been a, a, a Kante or a Wanyama or. I do like, you know what I'm saying? Wanyama. No, he's been good. No, he's I'm joking. Good. He's, he was good. He was good. I like that sound, though. What? What, he hasn't uh, been a... Yeah, uh, yeah. It's a bit meh. All right, let's go on to the next post. Squawker News says, Slavon Bilic on West Ham. Everybody is talking about a striker, but it's very hard to find them. We're working on it. What's your thoughts on this? You know, as a West Ham fan... Firstly, yep. I'd like to thank West Ham for the shirt they sent me. Oh, they sent you a shirt? Tottenham sent you one, didn't they? Yeah. They did? Yeah. I don't know about that. But <laughs> yes, bro, <laughs> let me tell you, man. What Slavon is saying is BS. Why? Because there's strikers out there, bro. You just got to get them. Look at the one, I keep telling you, the, the, the like Spanish who? kid. Like who? The Spanish kid that Everton just signed for 5.5 .5 million. What's his name? 14, hmm, 14 goals. Al Alaves or Malaga. That's the team. Yeah. So they're out there. Andre yeah, Gray. He's been signed, so who else is still No, but there? we could have got him early. So who can you get now? Um, Hernandez, step it up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What, what's going on with the Hernandez? If you want deal? someone, step it Listen, up. I want Hernandez. Yes. I want Hernandez. But if we don't get Hernandez, I'll take Joshua King. What, are you trying to sign him? Would you take Josh King? Yeah. At Tottenham. Bro, he had a phenomenal season. Back up, he's better than Janssen. So, transfer related have said, Danny Alves, and this is what Danny Alves said, if Pep Guardiola and Man City feel hurt, I'm sorry. I've come here to be a champion. Wow. All right, listen. Listen, Danny, Danny, hold up. All right, slow your roll, mate. 
what I don't understand is, mm -hmm. he's already been champion loads of times. Yeah. He's won it all. So what are you talking about, bro? You're a winner. When you're a winner like me, you just want to win all the time. You're not he's gonna. It's kind of like he has like goals to hit and targets to accomplish. Bro, you've accomplished it. Yeah, he's got another target. What? To win a league in another country. So Hector Bellerin mm -hmm. tweeted a picture. Now, if you look closely, he's in Cuba, bro. Ooh. And he said, "Heard you lot want me to work on my crossing," and he's crossing the street. And then she retweeted and said, "You're not even walking on the zebra crossing, fam. You really can't cross." Oh. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's actually funny. <laughs> but put the joke to the side for a sec. Yeah. So let's paint the picture. Bellerin follows me on Twitter. Yes. I went Cuba. I did button down shirt in Cuba and took pictures like this. What, on the zebra crossing? Just in the street, bro, almost getting run over, putting my life on the line for modeling and fashion. I didn't see none of them cars in your pictures. What? what? Go on the ground. Was it there? Anyway, yeah. anyway, it's because you follow like 10,000 people. <laughs> <laughs> Check my profile sometimes. My Spartans. Bro, two weeks later, he yeah, goes nah. Cuba. I'll be what honest footballer with you. goes Cuba? Whoa. I could name a few. Who? Chris Armstrong probably did in his day. All right, Gary Linegar has said, fullback Carl Walker becomes the world's most expensive defender at 50 million plus. Imagine how much he would cost if he could cross the ball. I'll be honest with you. Um, Carl Walker can cross the ball. He can cross the ball. You don't think he can? Yeah, into row Z. Nah, nah. He could cross the ball, but I like when he gets to the bar line and picks people out. And I think the modern day fullback is more about picking people out right, rather so than... He can, cut, he can do a cutback. He, he can cut back. He can't whip a ball in. He trust can, me, he can't whip a ball in. You see him play more than me, so I'm going to go with you on this one. But firing the ball to the front man, into midfield, he's got all of that, man. So sometimes, maybe he needs to work on his crossing, but maybe you don't. He's just become the most expensive defender for mm. a reason. You know what I mean? So. But was he second choice to Danny Alves? Was, it, was, he, a, was he the most expensive no, no. second pick? No, no. I knew... Yeah, I knew that Carl Walker was going Man City months ago. All right, BBC Sport says Tottenham are hoping to complete the signing of Estun Diantes. Estun Diantes defender, one foif. One foif. Um, <laughs> one foif. 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 What's that? One foif. Scottish. <laughs> one foif. Is that not how you say his name? Probably. Um, so for the first time, Tottenham mm -hmm. are involved in shrimping. Because they've been doing absolutely nothing, okay? There's been no activity. There's been a slight little flirtation with Ross Barkley. Mm -hmm. Bit of Lamar, but that's mm -hmm. it. Nothing's really happened. But now we've got one foif on the table. 19 years old. Uh, apparently it'll cost eight million. And uh, the president of his club is one Sebastian Varon. Oh, swear down. Mad thing. A lot of ones, a lot of ones over there. Well, there can't only be one, one. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I think that was good. It was all right. Chelsea have done a bit of business. They signed 22-year-old France international midfielder. Swear down. T How do I pronounce his first name? Tiemo. Tiemo Bakayoko. Is he Japanese? In it? I said this. Bakayoko. I said this. Is this the one I said I think was he's adopted? This is the one I said was Chinese or Japanese. Japanese. Chelsea are on tour at the moment. Yep. And uh, they've left Matic back home because apparently he's leaving. But Bakayoko made a point to go up to him in the dressing room, buy his locker and take a selfie with him. That's a bit rude. Like, mate, I'm taking your place in the team, but let's take a selfie. Man, I think that's brave. I think it's, I don't think he's done it on purpose though, to be honest with you. I don't really? think he knows. Did he know? Yeah. Sky Italy again. <laughs> he said, Sam Doria want Jack Wilshire, Arsenal asking for nine million pounds. So why don't West Ham, this is what I'm saying about there's no players out there. We need legs in the midfield. Go and get Jack Walsh. You're probably thinking he's going to get injured. You he might leg, do. You need legs in the he midfield. He might do. Boys, but... it's a catwalk. You need legs in the midfield. I don't get the catwalk phrase. Don't you mean... Because they, they use legs. Yeah, models, legs. Don't you mean we need, like, lungs in the midfield? No, legs. Okay. See, I'm old school. You know, some of the younger viewers probably think it's lungs, but legs, innit? You need legs, bro. Okay, cool. I mean... Why can't West Ham sign him? What, Jack Wilshire? Yeah. You want everyone. You want absolutely yeah, everyone. I do. Well, I want the players that we can get nine million for an English midfielder at this age. But, but he was benched at Bournemouth. So I, if you don't know, I'm going to tell you and the viewers, Doctor Who, they just announced they're going to have their first ever female doctor. Is it? It's a game changer, bro. You know, we're making progress. Next, there'll be a Black James Bond. But before we do that, there's a female Doctor Who. Can I just say something now? What? I don't want a Black James Bond. I'm sorry. 
I'm not one of he them people. He says this until he gets the casting call, and then he's like, oh, I'm Idris right. again, and he goes for it, and then that goes out the his principles. If they, no, if they casted me for it, I'm not turning down the role, and I know it's close, I'm hearing his murmurs. But um, I just, I'm just saying, I'm not one of them people, for instance, they're getting angry at so, a white Michael Jackson. So I'm, a white guy was going to play Michael Jackson. They've quoted jo Jose Mourinho and said, female doctor, <laughs> the BBC just lost itself a viewer. Is it? He didn't say that. He didn't say <laughs> he that. Didn't. <laughs> but they put a picture of Eva Canero, and uh, obviously, you know, it's a bit of banter. I like that. Have you seen? This is going to sound like I'm just getting onto girls now, but have you seen her pictures when she's like doing modelling pictures? No. Oh, amazing. Amazing. Yeah, yeah. Amazing. You That's send, all. You send me the link. I will send you the link. Send me the link. I appreciate women. Send me Get the link me. on Snapchat. All right, Go let's on. move on. So, SL, his name's just SL, he's tweeted, if Arsenal sign Lacazette, <gasps> I'll get a tattoo of his face somewhere on my body. <laughs> and he's thrown, he's thrown up this little symbol. But but the only problem... Bro! <laughs> the only problem is... I thought it was Darren Bent too, you know? No! Does Lacazette look like Darren Bent? He does. That could be Darren Bent. No, no, no. Or is it Lacazette? That tattoo does not look like Lacazette. But... Lacazette does look a bit like Darren Bent. T a teeny <laughs> little bit. I suppose. They're both doing beard gang. It's beginning to look a lot like challenge time. Mm. Questions everywhere. Oh. Right <laughs> answers from me. Wrong answers from you. Yeah, that was poo. All right, so listen. <laughs> no, you know what? Can what? I say something? Go on. I liked it. Did you like <laughs> it? I liked it. I, I liked got away it. With it somehow. I liked it. All right, so challenge time this week. With Michael Carrick being named Manchester United's captain, crazy mental for the upcoming season, we're going to test our knowledge of Premier League captains. Yes. Ho, 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 ho. So obviously, Mark Noble is West Ham's captain, <laughs> yeah. and who's Tottenham's captain? Harigo. Harigo. H Hugo Lloris. Hugo Lloris. <laughs> yeah. But how many more Premier League ca club captains do we know? I know them all, and all I'm right. going to prove that. All right. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Bro, it feels like it's been longer than a week. Sorry. Right. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Yes! Oh, hey. oh, yeah, and by the way, people, scissors. I won last week as well. No, but, no, no, against, against producer Greg. You ask me first. All right. Who is Crystal Palace's club captain? Oh, wow. <laughs> I know this. <laughs> Do you? Yeah, man, it's our Don. Thank you. <laughs> I don't know who our Don is. Um, club captain. Uh, it's RG. Bro, let's stop, stop talking to me. Um, oh, it's RG, my man. No way. No, 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 no. Five, four. It's Delaney. Three, two, no. It's Scott Dan. But listen, punching, I've seen him wear the armband a few times last season. So you actually thought it was punching and you was giving me the answer? Yeah. But <laughs> then you would have got it wrong anyway. He's an idiot. All right, go on, <laughs> ask me. Right, Craigie. What? Who is Burnley's club captain? It's so much harder. Uh, five. No. Yeah, man. Three. What? No. Five, three. Five, four, three, two, one, zero. Tom Heaton. Oh. It's one nil to me. Yes, it is one nil to you. Go for it. Who is Southampton club captain? Ah! Stephen Davis. That was easy, man. It wasn't easy. He's been there for Yonkers, bro. That, uh, uh, do you know where Yonkers is? I remember, he's our guy as well. We've talked, we spoke to everyone. Do you know where Yonkers is? Um, it's in New York City. All right, cool. Kind of, it's not really, it's not one of the proper All right, oh, it mate. Is, it is. They're getting all like, yeah, you've done well with that That's one. That's where D-Blocker from. You didn't think I knew that, innit? Come on. All right, ask me. All right, Craig, who is Swansea's club captain? Leon Britton. Ah! What's that? Two one. It's two one. How did you know that? I'm a sidekick. You're a sidekick. <laughs> that was so dead. Oh no, go on. I'm, you're rubbing off on me. Go on. Who is West Brom club captain? Chris Brunt. What? Chris Brunt. How did you know that one? I just play with him. Go on then. So it's 2-2. Two, two. Craig, who is Stoke City club captain? Easy, Ryan Shawcross. 
is easy. Ryan Shawcross, every come on, bro. This is easy. Just letting you know that. 3 2 to you, though, yeah? Who is Huddersfield club captain? Huddersfield. Um, good last game. Huddersfield. Huddersfield, Huddersfield, Huddersfield. Ah, oh, man, not getting this one. Huddersfield, 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 Huddersfield. Can't name it. Um, Five. No, no, no. Four. Three. Two. One. Centre back. Centre midfielder. Say the name. Neil Adams. Maybe that sounds like, sounds like a Huddersfield player. So I've won. Yeah. But this is for Banks. Go on then. Can I say something now? This whole challenge thing since Christmas has been banned for me because I've been about 17 uh, ahead. I was letting you know, you keep saying we this. We need to get this. scores on the doors. Um, Craig, who is Newcastle United club captain? I know it is. Let me, let me get my marbles. But it's for Bantz, just guess. What's the Don with the curly hair? The Beezus. No, what's his name with the... Colaccini. The yeah, Colaccini. <sighs> Colaccini? I know it's not. I know, but that's his answer. Him? No, that's his answer though. Yeah, but if he's you're not wrong. There, it's not an answer. Let's, Jama uh, Jam Jam Jamal Lascelles. Who? Lascelles. All right. Well. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> yes, two weeks in a row. Hey, I'm picking up some momentum again. Cool. Oh, well done. All right. It's happened. It's been good. Yep. Felt like longer than a week. But guys, let us know in the comments below what you thought of all of our little transfer rumours. What players do you think are going? Who do you think is staying? What do you want us to talk about? What do you want us to cover? Let us know mm. in the comments below. And uh, let us know where you're watching from, as usual, because we're loving all the countries yes. that are coming through. Are you in Cuba, like Bellerin? Do you like my South African accent? Is it any good? Oh my God. No, that's bad. That's bad. That's did bad. we ever get the names, the fans, uh, the name of our fans of this show? Well, not our fans, yeah. our, our, our family. Yeah. What? Alley cats. Tabby cats. Tabby cats. No. Tabby cats. Tabby. Give us a name. What do you guys want to be called, okay? You are the take about Alley cats could well. Alley, alley cats. I like that. That's cool. Let's see. Subscribe to the channel if you're new. Drop the video a like if you enjoyed it. Hit the notification button and uh, let's take a bow. We don't bang. take a bow no more. We oh, do yeah, that. We do. Bang, 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 bang. Wow.